today I'm going to talk about wheatgrass. This is wheatgrass right here. You see it says wheat pet grass right here. It says pet grass because they kind of use that to like, um, kind of, I don't know, I, I think they use that to be like, you know, take any kind of uh, liability away from them. But this is wheatgrass and people take wheatgrass. I take wheatgrass by like trimming off a little bit of it and putting it in my smoothie after rinsing it and making sure it's clean. Uh, that's what I do. I'm not recommending that you do it, but that's what I do. Uh, people buy wheatgrass supplements at the stores, and what wheatgrass does, I mean, are, th there, are claims, there are claims that it helps boost your immune system, fight off colds, and whatnot. Now, uh, these claims, I mean, some of these claims have been backed up by research, and some of them have not. I mean, have I noticed anything? I mean, it makes me feel good immediately after drinking. I'm not sure if it's because of a sugar dose or... Or, or what, but it makes me feel a little bit better. I, I, I mean, that's just my opinion. I mean, before you take any supplement, you might want to check in with your doctor or anything like that, but this is wheatgrass, and it grows. I water it, you know, like, you know, every couple of days, I water just a little bit because it's dry where I live, so uh, it absorbs a lot of water, but this is wheatgrass, and it's easy to cut. You see, I'm getting close to it right here. It's easy to cut, and it grows right back, and then I can use it again. But this is wheatgrass. Let me know if you have any uh, questions. Thanks a lot.